So always talk and listen to what the care manager is saying. Don't interrupt them. Don't talk over them. Do not try and lead them because they will not want to be uh, pushed in any way. You have to be delicate, but at the same time friendly, but also professional. And listen, good listening skills, communication skills is what's needed. If you are lacking communication skills and listening skills, then you will need to watch my videos on this because it is important that you're able to, to listen because that's how you get the sales because you will pick up on things that they are lacking and then you can look at helping them with that need as well. So you'll go through your presentation so that the organization understands what it is that you do and just let them know that you are going to be doing a, a presentation. You'll be talking to them from the presentation that you've already sent to them ahead of time so they know what this meeting is about and that they know that you want to close them, that you want to provide services to them by providing them with healthcare staff, doctors, nurses, for example. So that's how you do a telephone presentation of introducing yourself as an organization. So you've spoken with the client, you've arranged a meeting online and this is via Zoom. Excellent. So now what you're going to do is you will have your presentation open on your screen of what you've already sent to them and then you of your information pack that is. You'll then be doing a presentation about what it is that you're offering. You're basically going uh, uh, talking about your website. You're going to do a presentation PowerPoint about your services, about us, and your prices, and what types of staff members that you have, whether it's permanent or play, uh, temporary placement. What are your prices, your terms of business, but also talk in that presentation, have a section about what their questions are, what are their current needs at the moment, so that you're able to meet and match with what it is that they're looking for from a healthcare organization. Now, I always say to people, don't just say I provide nurses, uh, support workers, doctors, nurses, for example, Try and look at every aspect of what a care home needs. For example, cleaners, chefs, kitchen assistants. There's lots of other jobs that are needed in that care home as well. So I hope that you found that very helpful so far and I'll just continue with the Zoom presentation. So once you've gone through your presentation with the organization, the care manager, you want to thank them for their time, for taking out, you know, of their busy day, for spending that with you. But at the same time, you're also looking at and appreciating that you're able to help and this will benefit the care manager as well. Always ask them if they've got any final questions before the meeting ends. Then you're looking at getting the terms of business signed because you don't want to be sending any staff members in to the care home for example or NHS hospital for example without assigned time uh, terms of business so that that's very important as well so I hope you found this helpful please do like subscribe share and look out for all of the other future videos that we're coming up also if you haven't seen our previous videos then please do go back and watch them like i said like subscribe and share